Hey everyone, it's Alex and Ben. There he is from Longful Boots, and we're going to do another fuzz in the mix um, demo. Uh, feedback from the last one was minimal but positive, so we thought, why not? We'll do another one. Uh, this time we have got the track uh, called In the Middle of a Hole from the EP Men in Red Woolen Shirts. Um, this is a bit of a, a doomy one. We've got some big thick sounds on this one to explore. The song's kind of in two sections. There's like a doomy section at the start and then it gets a bit faster and then it gets really slow again. And we'll have a look at how the fuzzes sound in each of those different sections because um, they do react uh, differently to playing them differently. So this is how the song kicks off like this. <laughs> Uh, well, first of all, on the bass, uh, we're running the bass through a Devi Ever Sodomizer because, you know, why the fuck not? Um, it Which sounds is fitting because guess who did the vocal? I on know. This track? It's a certain Miss Devi yes. Ever of all people. Uh, so, yeah, so the, the bass is happening on the Sodomizer and it is a uh, frightening sound, frankly. <laughs> got an absolutely outrageous amount of low mids when you use it on the bit on the bass the sodomizer it's got a um it has this real low mid push uh, i'm always tempted to scoop quite a lot of mids out of bass sounds but um uh, this sort of forces you to, to deal with those low mids and it means that the bass comes through really strong um it's uh it's quite gated to us it's quiet when you're not playing it's got quite a cool attack to it i think i had the pre-game up you have to keep the pre-gain on the pedal a bit lower on bass anyway, but I had it quite a long way up. Uh, so you're getting the sort of compression at the front end of the notes. So we've got that swell at the start of the notes, which is really cool. Um, and we've got two layers of guitar tracks. The first one here is the Fat Freak from Gimp FX, which is... Uh, clone of a well-known bass fuzz uh, and that's sounding like this Relentlessly fat uh, tone from that uh, pedal. Uh, it works great on on guitar. You know, it's sort of traditionally a bass fuzz, I guess, but it, it works amazingly well on guitar, um, especially for sort of doomy stuff like this. We also found out more recently that it sounds incredible when you stack another fuzz into it. So if you're pounding, um, especially if it's sort of a medium gain fuzz into it, it just doomifies everything. It just sounds huge. Um, uh, great love for that pedal and the other guitar sound that's going on here is coming also from a gimp effects uh pedal which is uh, the thug which is a clone of the dam meathead this is actually the bright version um, and it sounds like this pedal sounds amazing on um, on guitar obviously uh, I haven't really tried it on bass so much have you? it's pretty good I was a little yeah. bit at home yeah uh, um, 
the thing I like about it, especially on guitar, is it's got a, a really nice mid range that comes through in a, in a, in a nice way. So um, after this Doomy section, things sort of pick up a little bit. So we'll just sort of cycle through the uh, parts again in this faster bit. Logic simply could not take that. Let's try that again. That's the thug there. Uh, we've got this, the uh, fat freak going on here. clean playing and we've got the bass going on here as well I think you can especially hear in this uh, faster section that really nice um, lower mid push that the sodomizer has on the bass back into the doomy section and uh, we bring in a couple of other little sounds as we go on. There is, of course, the noise floor, Devio and noise floor. Um, so much love for that pedal. That sounds like the chaos, which is probably turned on at that point. Yes. On, um, on its own, it sounds completely unmanageable. But when it actually comes in, um, you can hear it adding a, a presence to the mid range, an aggression. I think it's sat more or less down the middle of the mix when it first came in, yeah. And you can hear sort of an aggression to the middle of the mix coming in. Uh, it blends really nicely on top of the sodomizer on the bass as well. After that, a, a lead line comes in, which is a earthquake advisor's hoof, uh, and that's been run through an electroharmonics memory electroharmonics memory toy. That's what I'm trying to say. Uh, delay pedal, uh, which sounds like this. <laughs> I think towards the end of it, um, we st we start hearing some uh, knob playing. <laughs> um, uh, where the delay time has been altered uh, to create all those crazy sounds that delay pedals can make. <laughs>
everything descends into madness and uh, that's about it. Those are all the uh, sounds we've got running on there. Um, I especially like the the twinning of the um, the main rhythm sounds. I think they sound really neat when stacked on top of each other. In fact, if we just drop out to the start and listen to those two together on iso in isolation, I think that's... the bass into the mix things get uh, quite uh, quite thick that track um, let us know what you think in the comments if you want to hear any more uh, any other particular song um, go to our Bandcamp page longfullboots.bandcamp.com uh, have a listen to the tracks there if there's any that catch your attention that you want to know what fuzzes were going on in there then drop us a, a message in the comments or something and we'll uh, happily oblige see you next time <laughs>